Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to perform a magic trick, and then I will teach you the magic trick. This is a coin trick. It uses a ten pence piece. Now watch very closely. As I take the coin and place it here, I also have a glass. But I need something else. It's called the Shroud of Mystery. And here it is. Yes, it's a piece of tinfoil, but that's okay. <clears throat> I will apply the Shroud of Mystery to the glass. Perfect. Now, watch. If I move the glass over the coin, and everybody says higgledy piggledy, the coin vanishes. Well done, everybody. Now, how do we get the coin back? Well, we reapply the shroud of mystery. Everybody say higgledy piggledy. And look, the coin has returned. Well done, everybody. That was really good. You know, I don't even know how it works. To be honest, it's a great magic trick that you're going to learn in a second. But the weird thing about it as well is there was no glass. Magic Gareth here, and I'm going to show you how to do this vanishing coin trick, okay? All you need is a 10 pence piece, or any coin, really, any coin doesn't really matter. Put it on some sort of coloured table. Uh, you need a glass, and you need uh, the Shroud of Mystery, which in my case is a piece of tin foil. okay? Uh, now, there's something else. The sneaky bit, okay? This glass isn't all that it seems. Oh, no, 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 no. This glass has a fake lid. Now watch this. Look at the glass. So if you look really closely, there is a piece of the same paper or cardboard that you used here stuck to the bottom of the glass. And when you, well, the top of the glass, the bottom of the top of the glass, Turn your glass upside down, and it looks like the glass is just upside down, okay? But this is the secret. All you need to do when you move the glass is you cover up the coin, and it looks like the coin has vanished from inside the glass. Pretty good, eh? And when you want to reappear, you move the glass back. Now, the Shroud of Mystery comes in as the cover for it all, okay? Because if you move it around like this, people are going to go, wait, there's something fishy about that glass. Hmm. So you need to cover it. So you take a piece of tin foil, or a hat, or a sock, or uh, some clothing, a handkerchief, a tissue, a piece of kitchen roll, a towel, anything at all. Pop it on top, just to cover, okay? I like tin foil because it moulds around the shape. Now, you say, I'm going to make this coin vanish. Lift up everything. Place the cup over, okay? You say your magic words, higgledy piggledy, okay? And then you remove the shroud of mystery and reveal that the coin has vanished. <gasps> and you will get gasps from your audience because it's a really cool trick. But obviously you need the money back. So you reapply the shroud of mystery, say the magic words, higgledy piggledy, and you lift up the glass and the shroud at the same time. The coin is back. Wow, real magic. Pretty good, eh? So that's all you need to do the trick. A uh, piece of uh, tinfoil, anything to cover up the glass, a sneaky bottom of cup here, same colour as cardboard, and a coin. And that's called the vanishing coin trick. And I hopefully will see you again soon. Thank you, everybody. Bye-bye.